Welcome to Techno Analyst. Today we will see Hyper-V network. In my last video, uh, we will see that how to configure Windows 11 in Hyper-V service. So we will check how to how we will configure a networking in Hyper-V. So there are three types of networking switch in Hyper-V. First is external virtual switch. External virtual switch is all about it will establish connection to the physical network. The next one is internal virtual switch. And internal virtual switch in one line I will tell you it's a isolated network. Means it's that network which is connected to the host machine. Like uh, my host machine is a Windows Server 2022. And in that we will install one guest operating system which is Windows 11. So this uh, isolated network which is means that my Windows Server 2022 is connected to Windows 11 system but not to my Windows 10 operating system which is physical network which is physically installed on my laptop. The third one is the private virtual switch. It's a similar kind of internal virtual switch. So it's uh, connected to all internally guest operating system. Here I will summarize uh, all three network switches which is first one it's external switch which is physical to host machine host machine to virtual machines internal switch is host to virtual machines and private switch is only virtual machines so this is how all three uh, types of hyper-v virtual switch in my configuration where i configured windows server 2022 and in that uh, we will install hyper-v in that hyper-v we configured windows 11 operating system so we will try to establish the first one external switch we will install in that physical system should be ping in host machine and host machine should be ping with virtual machine. So what we will do we, we will uh, run an internet on physical system and those internet should work on host machine also on virtual machine. So let's see like first of all we have to click on server manager in server manager you can click on tools here you can see hyper-v manager click on hyper-v manager this is your system name so right now you can see one system is installed one vm is there which is windows 11 so what we will do first we will uh, click on settings Here you can see all the settings of hardware settings like you can see over here network adapter it is not connected so we have to install a network adapter so what we will do we will click over here virtual ma switch manager on virtual switch manager if you want this virtual uh, system should communicate with uh, physical network over. so we have to use external internal is for the this virtual manager uh, means communicate with uh, server only then we use internal and private is for only the how many virtual machine if you created in this uh, host machine like in this server only those machines can communicate with each other so if you are still have little bit confusion on this you can check my ppt which i shown you earlier so we will select external because uh, i like to create a communication between host and this virtual machine plus my physical system so we will use external click click on create virtual switch so here i can give a name like my virtual switch which will communicate to physical system, host machine and virtual machine. Three way communication. 
this this I will keep over here. Here we can ch choose a network adapter. Click apply. External network should be selected over here. Click apply. Yes. Now it will apply these changes. You have to wait. Click OK. <coughs> Sorry. Now we will go to the setting again. We will click over here. And here we can see my virtual switch. So I will click OK. You can click over here on network and this one. Click change adapter option. You can see over here. This is our switch name, my virtual switch, Hyper-V Ethernet adapter. This is connected to right now to the host machine. Right? Now, so now I will select net on this my VMware system and uh, let me check over here. Um, now we will check internet is working or not so google is pinging that means my internet is working right now so what setting we apply over here one more time i will show in the network director i select net so is used to share the host ip address so now internet is connected and working on the server system okay and on the server system we will get one of our my virtual switch okay and this is our physical network which is connected to the physical host machine so right now our physical network is connected to the host machine Okay, so these two stages clear right now with external switch. We are configuring external switch. So our VM should also configured. So let's try to connect VM. So now what we have to do? We minimize this, we minimize this, and we will open our VMware. And we will connect this virtual machine. I hope my system will not become slow. So just select your virtual machine, click on connect. Now I will log into my HyperV system. Windows 11 Hyper-V system after con configure external switch we will check my uh, internet is working over here or not so in the run command we will ping in the run window we will ping www.google.com-t You know, Google is also pinging over here. So, we successfully established connection between physical machine to host machine and host machine to VM machine. So, this is how you can setting external switch. And that is the use of the external switch in virtual switch. So, the moment I will just minimize this.
this is my server system in server system also i will run google.com this is my server system and this is my hyper v so this is my server system it is google.com is pinging over here in hyper v also it is pinging and my, my physical network is also working so we successful create a connection between I would like to do that yes uh, here on my PPT is access to HTTP connection between physical switch to host and host to view so this is your use of external switch in uh, hyper-v networking please subscribe my channel and thank you